It's Monday. It's Halloween, actually. If you saw my Halloween costumes this weekend, they were fun and they were easy. Woke up to 6K followers on Instagram, gone like that. Apparently, it was a data breach. Crazy morning. Now I'm eating Tim Hortons. I need to get groceries or else I'm gonna eat like shit all week because we are building a pop-up. Oh, we have to go to Canadian Tire. I just realized that my American followers literally won't know what Canadian Tire is, which is crazy. What I need to get is, I don't know what it's called, an adapter for a hose to connect to the sink and a painter's tape. Get you whatever you want. one of these things, but I got one that was too big. I need one that fits, fits this. It looks good though, it looks amazing. Oh, I love it. This is probably what I would be doing if I wasn't. I mean, if you're gonna source another one, what do you like? Something more mid-century. <laughs> it's right there. No, turn around, turn around. Right there. That Swedish Coca-Cola. You put this on like a psychopath. Like, why is the ketchup is all on the whole entire thing? The Swedish Coca-Cola is extra carbonated. Also, Jonathan led me astray with this dairy-free one. Who gets them at the same time? I'll do whatever you do. Let's take cover before our chances are getting darker. But I want you to know I can't help but fight this feeling I want you to try. I was at the pop up all day and now it's like seven. Went home, did some work. Now it's seven. I have to go to IKEA, pick up some more furniture and stuff. Building a pop-up is a lot of work. My dad came today and like did all the carpet like change room and all the stuff that we need a professional for, which is great. He had like a free day. Otherwise, I don't know. We would have hired a task rabbit, I guess, but it's a lot of work. It's 24-7 for a full week. So let's go to IKEA. This is my IKEA outfit. Grandpa cardigan, the best. I love this cardigan. Blue MA top, Levi's works. I'm in grade seven again. I love it. Okay, it's actually kind of the end of the day, but we've been here all day setting up, figuring it out. It looks coming along. We open, um, we have a party tomorrow. So I think I might have showed you the carpet already. I'm not sure. We've got this like orange event carpet, all the racks. Bobby painted this beautiful striped mural thing. Got some furniture, more racks. We had to put all the baseboards in because this place didn't have fucking baseboards. It's Christmas tree, that, and then we got this bar off of Facebook Marketplace, $60. And then my dad came and built this change room for us because this didn't have a change room. It has like a nice little door. And then we just had to put a light and a mirror in there. Hey, MTV. Welcome, Welcome to my, my crib. <laughs> but it's coming along. We just have like... Minimum 12 to 16 hours of hard manual labor. Yeah. Cleaning, dusting, steaming. So we need to- So our inventory hasn't come in yet. Yeah, so we are still, we're still waiting on inventory that's well, at the border. There's so much cleaning to do. We've probably been here for, for oh, there's our alcohol. Alcohol's arrived, so that's good.
you should be directing them in traffic. You got tons of Last night we were there until like 12 now it's 8 anyway i gotta go back we got all of our inventory well not all of it we got some of our inventory in for the comic last night so yeah to go back <sighs> i'm so tired keep bringing these yep i'm gonna <laughs> help you Currently 1 p.m. Seven hours left. It's n it's not glamorous. Building a pop up. I am at Canadian Tire for the one billionth time. We're almost done, guys. Almost, almost, almost. We need to get all the inventory sorted, and then we can go home and get ready. We have the party tonight. Ah! Let's go to Canadian Tire for the one billionth time. I'm getting Christmas lights and more clothing racks. with just some flat boots because I honestly like I couldn't put heels on. My body hurts. I just had to get ready in literally 45 minutes. I couldn't even steam my dress. But this is the maiden dress, one of my favorite in the collection. Let's go do this media party. Good morning. We're tired. This could be the most tired I've actually ever been in my life. And you guys know I love complaining about being tired. We had a party last night. I'm just cleaning up from it. It was so good. Guys, the space looks amazing. Thank you to everyone who came through. It was mostly friends and family and Today we open the actual store, so it's gonna be a big day. Let's get this all cleaned up. Opening that U-Haul was very 
dramatic. I couldn't close it. Like I had, I couldn't. I didn't have the energy yesterday to close it. <laughs> like shove like it. I couldn't get it. And, but I shoved. I'm so so sorry how it looks. Like I was literally panicking, just throwing boxes. It's there. fine. There's nothing. It actually is a little bit organized, but it's not even unorganized. It's Towards the end, it gets. I was overwhelmed with how many boxes there are, and we're about to get seventy cartons. Nice. Okay, like, why is it so foggy? I've never seen this much it's fog in my spooky. life. It's so spooky. <laughs> so we rented a bunch of cups. So I'm just putting them back in the cartons, and then they're gonna pick them up. And then we got champagne flutes from our friends at. That's it. Sh free. Freaks in it, freaks in it. I don't know, I can't, can't. Brain can't compute right now. And we had some barbet and yeah, that's what we're doing. That's what I'm not, what I'm doing. Shrin's getting the change room sorted. We're opening. And we're officially open. If anyone was wondering what we were doing in the pop-up, um, all of our inventory was kept out back here because we didn't have a back room and we had so much inventory so fucked so now we're replenishing and we're bringing all the inventory in because you can't stay outside all night <laughs> so happy it didn't rain <sighs> tired yesterday my car wouldn't start which was really annoying because i just got it fixed but obviously something else is wrong we had a great day and we had to go to a little bubble gum ball last night for breast cancer it was it took everything in me to go now we're up Going back to the store. It's gonna be a great day. I'm trying to tell myself I'm so tired. Yeah, I look really gross, but whatever. Packing setting spray and a beauty blender. Packing a lip liner. My wallet. Or half my credit cards are, but you know, whatever. Keys. I'm gonna try to see if my car works again today, but I don't think that it will. I pack my outfit, which I'm wearing my little crop tank. Cute. I'm gonna wear my maxi skirt today. Well, I'm gonna wear my chunky knit card again, I think. Then I'm gonna wear my Kate shoes. I don't know where they are. Kate shoes. And then I also have to bring Sharon's sneakers because she was here last night. And I think that looks good. I guess I should bring a phone charger. Camera, two bottles of water to finish. And that's it. Let's go. Moment of truth, my car works. Please, 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 please. Oh! What a fucking day! Oh my god. You don't understand, guys. Yesterday it wouldn't turn on. Today it does! Oh, sweet fucking relief. Woo! But you know what I think is gonna happen? I'm gonna park it on the street and then it's gonna die. But it fucking works. Okay, need to get gas. A fun fact my mechanic told me, I did not know this. You shouldn't let your car go below quarter of a tank it fucks up your fuel pump and i didn't know and i drive my car until there's literally no gas left like one little bar maybe no bars left fucks up your fuel pump didn't know fun fact you shouldn't do that around quarter of a tank you should fill up I had no idea took a CBD melatonin gummy and I had the craziest dreams of all time. Like melatonin really just, my dreams are fucking insane. Now, pack my bag again. And this time, what I forgot yesterday, well, I need to bring some hair stuff for Sharon. I'm bringing lidocaine foot spray because my feet are fucking killing me. This is really bringing back the days where I used to work retail and we had to work in flip flops. And that's all I'm gonna bring. Oh, I need to bring lip chop. I didn't bring lip chop yesterday. Does everyone call it lip chop or is that just a Canadian thing? I don't know. Oh, there's my bra. I was looking for that. I brought a dress. I brought some other shoes. I'm gonna bring another pair of shoes too. I don't know what I'm gonna wear. I might do some outfit changes. Let's go. Ready to go. My car turned, oh yeah, you saw my car turned on yesterday. That was great. I brought 
my Proenza shoes. I feel like I should bring in another pair of boots too. I don't know if I can put heels on. Like literally my feet hurt so much. I'm gonna bring these boots too. They did hurt my feet a lot, but I'm probably not gonna wear them that much. Okay, let's go. It smells like rotten apples in my car. It's kind of concerning. Okay guys, moment of truth. Every day is an adventure when you don't know if your car is gonna start. Uh. Fuck. Come on, please. Why, why, why? Come on. Fuck. Not the day. Crazy, it's actually like 10.30 because daylight savings. All right. Brutal. I have to call a fucking Uber now. I knew it wasn't going to start. I just knew it. I just knew it. I just knew it. I just knew it. Today's just been one of those mornings. Washed my hair, came out of the shower, blue dry, blue dried, blow dried my hair, and then it was still looked greasy. Fuck you, car. I guess I could walk. Mm -hmm. I don't think I have time. Uber it is. Well, I don't think I've actually showed you around the pop up space. I'm gonna show you. So we have the little curtains little section. This was actually over here, but we have a coffee bar now. All of our clothes. Some orange carpet. More clothes. Plants. We have a little display table. This was actually someone's Canada Dry that we had like when we were setting up, but we actually felt it looked so good on the table. It like, goes with the set, you know? The, this is our 70s. My vision was a 70s living room at Christmas. And here we are. And then this is all of our inventory. We have like a thing in the back that holds all of it, but it's, it all doesn't fit. So bring it in every night. Okay, so I have to bring all the inventory back out and then get this place cleaned and set up for day three. I forgot to bring lip chop and I forgot to bring gum. The two things I uh, meant to bring. So tired guys, you have no idea. This has been just a crazy, crazy week. Building the store in four days and then working the store for three plus a party. It's been crazy. I'm gonna actually make a TikTok about everything that I've learned and what I would do differently. Anyway, I have to actually do my job now. Okay. Um. 